Hello everyone, Gent here, Golden State Times, and today we got an article courtesy of USA Today, and it reads, Target adding single stall bathrooms to all stores. So, basically what the article says is big, big box retailer Target will add single stall bathrooms to all of its stores where that option isn't currently offered. Reflecting a direct response to the debate that erupted earlier this year over its new transgender bathroom policy. Target Chief Financial Officer Kathy Smith told reporters Wednesday that the company would invest $20 million to add single stall bathrooms. So it also goes on to say that there's 1,800 stores and around 1,400 of them do not have this option and that's where they're planning to put it. If you remember earlier this year, there was a boycott target pledge petition going around from the AFA, American Family Association, and um, a bunch of people signed. It looks like 1,399,848 people signed the pledge. As the pledge started to gain traction and pick up steam, target started to lose money. As of right now, they lost around $25 billion. So I really don't understand why it took them to lose $25 billion to just figure out that they could have just invested $20 million and added a new stall and none of this would have ever happened. But I'm kind of lying because I know exactly why they did it. They like to follow the PC crowd and they cared more over political correctness than safety. And that's why 1,400,000 people signed the pledge. Now, I hope that they go through with what they're saying. Because if they don't, we will continue the boycott of Target. And it will only get worse. So, yeah, guys, let us know what you think below. If you signed this petition a few months back, let us know also. And give us your opinion about what's going on with all of this. And uh, just a side note, as you can tell Walmart never joined this bandwagon. And they only profited off of it. So that's what happens to these people that think that, you know, that PC is better than safety. And it serves them right to lose all that money. I myself haven't haven't shopped at Target in over uh, I don't know since the beginning of the year actually, since Christmas of last year actually. Um, I continued my pledge for over eight months, and I will continue it as long as if they don't go uh, along with this with what they're saying, I will continue that boycott. I hope you do too. So if you still want to sign this, I'll, I'll link it below. I'll link this article below. Let us know what you think. Express yourself in the comment section below. Like this video. Follow us on Twitter and like us on Facebook. All of the links are below. And if you want to contribute anything to keep us going, there's also a link for PayPal in the description below. Until next time, guys. Have a good one. See you next time. Peace.